Hi guys, um, today's video is a little bit different than normal because normally I pick one topic and uh, talk about it in some sort of way but today I want to just to make a castle, uh, castle to you video and um, discuss a little bit what happened in my life and some uh, events that happened for example, Mark hitting 10 million subscribers on YouTube. This is a big um, number of subscribers. And I know he is really proud of it. And I'm really proud of him. And I know I can say for a lot of people that they are also proud of him. Especially since what happened a couple of um, weeks ago that uh, Daniel passed away and I know we will uh, support um, Mark no matter what this is the same for all his other friends and friends uh, from Daniel so another thing I want to talk about is Phil Lester or aka Amazing Phil hitting 3 million subscribers this is a lot less than Mark, but I don't care. I'm either way. I'm proud of um, Phil also because yeah, he was on two point I don't know what a million subscribers for a really long time, and I think he really deserves um, those three millions. And yeah, I don't know exactly how long I have been following him, but I know him quite well as possible uh, via YouTube so yeah and then another um, th topic I wanted to talk about it is in combination from Phil Lester and Dan Howell it is their book the amazing book is not on fire I'm really proud that uh, they wrote um, that book and shared all those uh, stories with us I haven't um, re read the book yet but I, I know for sure I am going to read it and I know it will be an amazing book so yeah oh by the way I will leave Mark's link and Phil Lester's link and the link for the amazing book is not a fire in the description below so you can check um, them out and you can check the book out or buy the book which is really lovely um, and then the fourth one I wanted to talk about is school uh, I think I have said it, this uh, quite a couple of times but still I'm in a second year of college it is a quite busy study and you have to do a lot of work so for example the last period I had to write a I don't know if you know the word description or report or whatever you call it but I had to read a thing which was about 20 pages big or something so that took a lot of time and I'm really sorry if you guys miss my videos and I to be honest I miss making videos and I am still awkward um, talking to just a camera and I have no idea what to say and my life has been a bit hectic lately so but I can't um, really give uh, that much of detail about those hectic things because I think they are more uh, personally to me and yeah I don't really want to share those things in that much detail but I can say one thing that one of those problems is that there is a guy in my class or uh, I'm group B and he is in group A but either way I like him Sometimes I just deny my feelings, but 
one way or another I always end up talking to him and being with him on uh, school we at the moment we are just friends but I still like him a lot and he also said that he doesn't like me or that he is ready for a relationship yeah I'm struggling with this a bit so I'm sorry guys about this so I have to sort this out I know love is a difficult and hard th uh, topic sometimes and it causes broken hearts and yeah another thing about the topic love or whatever i described a couple of seconds ago is that someone i knew started a relationship with uh, someone else but it is just a friends with benefits relationship and i wanted to know what do you guys think about a friends with benefits uh, relationship so yeah i don't really know myself if it is gonna work or not and how it will end up i know for sure that the guy in the relationship loved the other girl but the girl doesn't really know if she loves that guy and stuff so please guys help me i want your opinion on this so please help me and i uh, leave a please leave a like like and subscribe and i will you and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.